Hey guys, it's Kiki Love and Kiki Loves You. Um, I wanted to make a video really quickly. If you hear something, it's probably the car because I'm sitting in the car. Hopefully it's not too, too loud. But anyway, um, and y'all are sitting on the car. So hopefully it's not bad. Well, let's just turn the car off because I mean, I don't have the air on anyway. Yeah, so I'm sitting in my car right now. Um, I wanted to make this video really quickly because the sun, I feel like the sun might be going out. It's a lot going on. I thought I have more time to be at home, but looks like not right now. I'm just out and about. This weekend, I really just haven't been at the house. But I wanted to make this video really quickly. Not really quickly. I wanted to make this video real quick. But, um, and it's in regards to all of, all of this happening in the world. Um, and with Black Lives Matter and uh, the injustices that continue to happen and continue to plague more people. And it's mainly and mostly about the people that are mad because their faves are not speaking up or they're not speaking how they want them to and not saying the things that they would want them to say in this time. And I get that to an extent, but that is why it's important to go and vote. I don't expect the baby, uh, love him, but I don't expect the baby to be able to articulate himself in such a way that my local governor could, right? Because he doesn't do that. Like that's not what he ever said he could do, right? I don't have it in me to expect that of them when they, aren't in the position that they are off of that merit like i don't put that type of responsibility onto them i expect them to if anything use their music to speak out about that because that's what i listen to them for right i listen to their music so i expect them to do that not to first of all i'm ashy as all outdoors i expect them to use their music to do that not necessarily to be able to have a, a <laughs> an articulate conversation about such matters right so I'm looking to them to use their music, to use their platform, to maybe post where people can sign petitions or maybe go out and protest and, you know, be in the streets if that's how you get down or, you know, um, donate money or, you know, things like that. Do things that are practical, that make sense, but I'm not looking to them to speak out. Um, that's the problem. If you expect them to do things and to change legislations and stuff like that, that's not okay. Um, I would expect them to use their influence to, you know, speak on those those matters when they can and, you know, make that way. But I don't expect them to change laws because that's not what they do. They're not politicians, right? They're not governors. They're not senators. They're, they're none of those things. I expect them to speak on those subjects when they're asked about it. But maybe they won't, you know, say it the best way they can because honestly, and this, I'm not talking about the baby and when I say the rest of this stuff like or anything beyond that. Like I would, I don't expect these rappers or these singers even to be able to have these type of conversations because I've never known them to have these conversations outside of that, right? There are some artists that I listen to that I know for sure, for sure, I can say, hey, they can hold their own and have this conversation. But then there's some that I'm like, I don't even know if they can handle a sentence. Let's be honest, okay? I, I don't know if they're gonna make it, honey. So I don't have the expectation of all of them. Uh, and to those of you that feel like you do, man, maybe reconsider that. And before you get mad at, you know, an artist that you listen to all the time, man, maybe ask, is, is your governor pulling that weight? Is your senator pulling that weight? You know, your mayor, the people in your city, are they pulling that weight? You know what I'm saying? And I'm not saying that to be like, oh, don't give them any type of responsibility. Yeah, hold them to the fire too. But make sure the people that you have in office around you are doing those things. And if you're underage and you can't vote right now, or if you're, you know, you're about to vote for the first time, or you know, you don't know how this necessarily works, man, watch some videos on it. You know, I mean, or just learn on the person you got as your current mayor. I'm not saying you need to know about everybody and how everybody operates, man. Just try and learn, take your city and learn the people in your city and what they do. That's it. Just take, try start with your mayor. Right, just take your mayor and and see what your mayor does. See what the city does with the budget, with the the budget that you all get. Right, look it up. Look up city hall, town hall. You know, look up that stuff. Take a little time and look into it. And I'm not saying it's gonna be easy. I'm not saying you got all the answers, but I'm just saying like, man, check your city hall, your local city hall. Right. So just type in like your county and look on the website. Just browse around the website, right, and see what they they have to say and how they're divvying out money and and stuff like that right so hold your people accountable that i mean that's just what i'm doing right and i'm telling you that because that's what i'm doing that's what i'm looking at like hey so how do we have ex how do we have all this money going to the police force but when it comes to health care right now we're only getting this much there like 
how how is that working out that doesn't make sense like who's over the budget how is this working out who's running it so i've been keeping up with the dockets and watching that type of stuff yeah so yeah um excuse me um don't put so i'm, I'm just gonna advocate that you don't put your spade celebs on such a high pedestal um that shoot maybe only somebody like your senator or your governor belongs on and also man try and learn about it if you can or you know ask people that know yep and so that's it and so until next time guys another kiki loves you and i'll see y'all in my next video i'm out